Golf with your friends is the first mini golf game that we all picked up as a community and started playing for sub nights. Uh, and really, ultimately, I feel like it's my favorite. There's so many different things you could do just in the core game. Uh, with the way they've implemented different gameplay types, they've taken the Rocket League approach of saying, you know what, yeah, Rocket League, it's, uh, it's like soccer, but with cars. But it could also be basketball, but it could also be hockey. Like, you know, it's kind of taking that approach and they allow you to do that uh, in Golf With Your Friends as well. The one thing it's lacking is a proper editor, but they just recently added uh, an editor test. Like they basically, he has an internal editor that he's working on and he's publishing maps to the, uh, uh, I'll show you actually. <clears throat> we'll go do forest, let's see, here we go, workshop. And he's actually publishing them to the, uh, to the workshop. These are all custom maps that he's uh, that he's uh, testing right now. There's only six of them, but if we could hop into one, we could see just just you know what what kind of complexity there is in terms of like the level design. Actually, no, we wouldn't be able to see that because we can't necessarily see what the uh, uh, how they made it. So we won't do that. Let's go back. Actually, these are the maps that you start with. Seven maps. Uh, they are they they are all very very different. Um, I'm very curious how he's gonna do a level editor because this I do feel like the level design in, in Golf with Your Friends is more complex than anything else, and so I'm very curious uh, than the other two games that we've covered. So I'm very curious to see how he ends up implementing that. Implementing that, but it's also it's not out yet, right? So it's, so who knows what's gonna happen? You know, in a few weeks or a couple months when he actually ends up releasing that. Uh, the core game, however, is also the cheapest at like six bucks or something. Whereas golf, uh, golf it is like eight dollars, and golf uh, infinite mini golf is like fifteen bucks, right? Give or take a dollar. Um, let's go back. You can also customize your balls here. Who doesn't like that? Look at that. You gotta uh, get some hats. Let's see. Da, 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 da. Uh, it's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> it's pretty good. You can also buy and sell hats on the market if you wanted to. Uh, sure. Let's go with that. Yeah. Let's go. Uh, let's go back. Cool. And then we can change the ball color. Right there, we go. Make it look delicious. Look at that, man! It's delicious. There you go. Maybe give a maybe more of a yeah. Mm, there we go. That's good. Let's see. Go skins. Uh, no skins. No skins yet. Trails. Let's empty. Unlock my. Oh, oh wow! I don't have any trails unlocked. Damn! I thought I did. Floaties coming soon. Wow! I thought I had some uh, some trails unlocked. Whatever. Oh, I didn't save my shit. <laughs> yes. Okay. Also, uh, color. Uh, green. Perfect. Apply. Perfect. Good. All right. So now we can go online, offline. Online mode supports up to, I believe, like 12 people. Yeah, 12 people, there you go. You can set a password on the room if you wanted to. No issues whatsoever with online play at all. Um, it's You can have collision set, you can do all kinds of crazy stuff. You can have different types of balls. Actually, I'll show you that. So online, host, uh, 12, uh, let's see, uh, test room. And then we'll put a pass it, that done. So we can actually go through and uh, see classic, go to dunk, which is basketball. We go to hockey if we wanted to, <laughs> or we go to custom. This is where I actually go through and you can save presets, thankfully. Uh, but you can actually go through and make some like serious changes. A golf type, or golf, well, goal type, hoops, hockey. Uh, let's see, ball size, we can make it uh, large or random each. Uh, large, let's see, bounds reset, we can reset on touch, you can make it uh, allow bounce out, yeah, so there you go, people can bounce outside the map and keep on playing. Uh, allow jumping, bouncy ground, we can make this super bouncy, uh, low gravity, uh, let's see, there, 0.25, this should be pretty crazy. Uh, probably actually won't let me, let me play though, because I have the uh, number of uh, players to the 12. Let's see, retry shot mode, show last power, all this is pretty handy stuff. Collision mode, I mean, that's the salt generator right there, ball shape. Uh, egg, cube, cylinder, cone, isosphere, puck, star, bobble, acorn, random each. Random each is pretty hilarious because somebody always gets stuck. Someone will always get stuck with like the worst thing while everybody else is like succeeding with whatever it is that they got. Uh, this is very similar to Infinite Mini Golf. Infinite Mini Golf has the option to choose different types of balls. Uh, Golf It does not. Golf It is a very straightforward, this is your spherical shaped ball, please hit it towards the goal type of gameplay, or cup rather, type of gameplay. Whereas uh, uh, golf it or golf with your friends takes it uh, many many steps further by allowing you to basically do whatever you want. So apply. Uh, I wonder if I can start. Oh, cool! It's gonna let me in. Awesome. Good. I can show you guys how this functions this way. 
Unless somebody guessed my passwords and hops in. Let's do. All right. So, <laughs> I forgot they have the goalie. All right, so the way that you stroke in, uh, in golf with your friends is you hold down the left click button and you move your power to what you want and then you let go. Pretty simple. Oh, fuck, I forgot it's a red toe. <laughs> Play with a cone. Oh, man. Yes, so it is not... So, golf it's... You basically swing your mouse, and however hard you swing it is uh, is how hard you hit it. Golf, infinite mini golf, and golf golf with your friends uses the same type of power based setup. Oh god, and it's right, jumping. I forgot about jumping. Actually, I might jump into this. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh. yeah. Let's uh, let's try to set ourselves up a little bit better here. No, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump. Okay, jump. Wait, wait, keep jumping, keep jumping, keep jumping, keep jumping. There we go, there we go. I can keep this thing, keep this thing going. Get back in the map, get back in the map. I need to get the, the thing to turn around. Turn around. No, it's not happening. Reset, reset, reset. Thank you. <laughs> I just want to quit so bad. Okay. <laughs> I just want to get stuck with the code. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yes! Go me! And then now it's on to the next one. Oh, Jesus. Oh, good. I got a cube this time. Oh! Duh. <laughs> the goal, by the way, the goalie is completely, completely random. Shit. The goalie is 100% random. Tried sitting here and figure out what his, what his uh, pattern was, and there, it doesn't seem like there is one. If there is, it's a very long pattern. Here we go. You might recognize this from the, uh, what was it? Uh, golf it from the golf it gameplay. Same concept, slightly different looking. What is this? Oh, this is the, uh, isosphere. Yeah. Bouncing was a bad idea with low gravity and, and like, and, and heavy or, uh, high bounce. Yeah. That was dumb. That's why it's just taking forever. This is actually a terrible example of the physics of the game. I should probably actually change it because you guys are probably like, Whoa, everything's so bouncy. I don't blame you, actually. Because that was a bad example by setting everything up. What the hell was that? To do it, to do all that crazy bouncing and low grab and all that shit. Hold on, I'm going to sneeze. Okay, pardon me. Let's see. Uh, Forest Classic. Let's go and actually go to... Uh, let's go to... Candyland. Oh, yeah. We all love Candyland. We'll do, like, just typical. There we go. I look how complex this is. Like, this is not... I, I don't understand how he's going to make an editor out of this, but I, I, I welcome it. There's so many moving parts. There's so much cool stuff that, that you could do with the... Uh, or that, that he's, he's done with the levels. Very curious to see what he does uh, for... Uh, not enough power. Woo, going downstream, resets, there we go. More power, three, three bars. Oh, oh guys, more than three bars, okay. You know, I've done this map so many times, so many times, I still don't remember what I need to get. I don't think it's four bars, four bars is crazy. There we go, perfect. Like three and three quarters. I. oh my God. This is what I get for like, swapping between golf games, my, uh, my game is off. I <laughs> used to the physics. But this is good. At least you guys get to see how this game actually plays. Whoop. Way too much power. Not enough power. That should do it right there. Oh, man. Why couldn't I do that the first time? Birdie bogey. Birdie. Lol. That's <laughs> not happening. You stroke out like that. Here we go. Here we go. And bam! Too much power. Now we're back behind here. Awesome. Where is the end? Over there. Okay, cool. We can make this. Man, your boy caught it. <laughs> All right, next hole. Let's go. Too much. Too much. Just a little bit. There we go. Follow it down, get it. That was not the right hole, but we'll take it. It's fine. And 
the music doesn't loop very well. <laughs> I just noticed that usually I have the music turned off because the music is kind of repetitive. All right, so that's pretty much the gist of this this map. Kind of want to like test test my skills here. Come on, come on, come on. Oh baby, we're gonna leave right there. On that note, let's go ahead and leave because I got to show you guys uh, uh, basketball mode still. Offline, single. Uh, let's see, we already have forest. Let's go ahead and do haunted, and we'll do mode dunk. There we go. Apply. Let's see, da, 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 da. it should be good. Let's go. All right. So you can see the goal over there, the basket. Oh. Let's see. Come on, baby. Not quite. But you can jump. I forgot about that. You can jump, which uh, obviously helps a lot. You can bounce the ball basically if you need to. So maybe like right there then? Is that it? Is that is that the There it is. Oh finger. Oh my god. Oh it's fine. It's fine. Oh, she's underneath the hoop. They give us a setup here. We can move forward. <laughs> There it is. All right. <laughs> so and I can imagine this now with like, you know, 11 other people and having a uh, collision on all that stuff. The collision imagine makes it very just treacherous. Um, but yeah, there's just so many different things you could do. And there's so much chaos that could be had. And it's actually a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. I would say that this is probably the most fun because of the diversity in different ways you could play uh, with puck ball uh, or puck basketball or regular golf. Damn, my hops too much. I went, in, went in and out, in and out. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus, it'll be worse. Yes! Yeah, I would definitely say the only, the only limitation here, the only thing that sucks is that it, the, the editor is not out yet. I wish... I want to turn this out a little bit. I wish that the editor was out so that way I could show you guys, you know, more of an apples for a apples to apples comparison. Because right now it's like, yo, this is good, but it could be better because we can have custom maps and everything. So I'm very curious to see what happens when, when that comes up. But again, it's also the cheapest of the of, of the group. So that might be, um, dang it. That might be uh, a good selling point, I think. Oh, God. There we go. There we go. Let's see. Oh, this is a good one. Uh, if I could get this just right here. Uh, not quite, but you know, it works actually. Nice. Right to the end. Otherwise, you have to go through all, all the course and everything, but who wants to do that? Finally. Oh my God. <laughs> I was like, finally, some skill here. Mm. Get any bounce in, double bounce in. It's fine. Right? It still counts. Oh, Jesus. Ah, uh, nope, nope, not quite. We got bounce, bounce out. Nope, no, nope, nope. So yeah, like it's gonna be. If, if we want to uh, compare this apples to apples, we're gonna have to wait for the editor to come out. Um, but still, even without the editor, I would still say this is my favorite of the three golf games. Uh, the physics feel really good. The uh, uh, just yeah, I mean the physics is actually the biggest thing. It's it's freaking golf. Of course, the physics have to be good. I mean, sorry, I can bounce my way in, bounce my way in. Come on, come on, keep moving. Nope, lost the momentum. All right, cool. Um, the uh, the gameplay options, there's plenty of them, and uh, they're all so different that you could just, yeah, you could just create your own, create your own fun, basically. Oh, let's play basketball on such and such map, whatever. Sure, let's do that. Let's play uh, hockey on such and such map. Yeah, good, we do that. Easy. Super easy. Let me see here. Let me see if I can get a good. Nope. Not quite. Oh gosh, I still no no no. I'm right directly underneath it, aren't I? Yep, sure am. So there's no there's no making that. Back off a little bit. Add a stroke. Turn around. Oh god. <laughs> uh. Here we go, man. Ah. See now now I'm just playing for the challenge. Oh, here, hold on. let's see over here. Oh. <laughs> I thought I could clear that. I can make that. Hold on, I can make this. Good, good. Keep going, because that, that chair, that uh, table will push you. No, 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 no. Oh, come on. I've never seen it actually do this, though. Usually it just shoves you around. Uh, I've never landed on it, though. 
Is this is this my life now? Oh good, I could uh I could step off of it. Okay, well I guess now I'll let it reset. <laughs> Way back to the beginning. Uh, there we go. There we go. No 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 no. And that's off the map. <sighs> Maybe I should just ride this thing out. This is right. Oh gosh. Hit the edge, hit the edge, edge, edge. Oh, okay, yes! Okay, now hit it, hit it. Come on, come on, come on. Keep, keep it up, keep it up. Okay, we can keep this thing going. And we can wait for him to come around. And then when he comes around, we can ride this thing for a minute and then hop off. Good, good, good. Oh! Ah, damn it. All right. <laughs> now we have to go because uh, he will come around and slap us off, of course. Ooh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Ooh, okay right here, right? Yes. Okay, there we go. Oh, <laughs> perfect. <laughs> oh man, just terrible score, man. Ridiculous. God, uh, whatever. There's Casper over there. Nah, try this again. Let Casper get it. Pushes you away. That's it. You can see a circle at the bottom it shows you where the uh, where the power is. Where the pushes. Oh man, <laughs> I'm tired of this. <sighs> All right, let's see. Uh, let's do some, do something else. Let's see. Uh, we do offline again. You know, I, I obviously with any multiplayer game, it's gonna be more fun when you play with friends, right? Uh, especially a game called Golf with your friends. Um, I it, it this does get pretty chaotic and pretty crazy when you play with friends and collision on that everybody's basically bouncing into each other. Um, but it's also still a lot of fun. People get upset when their ball gets bounced around, but you know what? It's fine. They're just, they're just whining. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, we did dunk. Uh, we did hockey. Uh, we did, we, we did, do we do classic? I don't know. Let's do classic. Here we go. Do a little Oasis classic for y'all. All right. Hmm. There's a hole at the very top of this. I don't know what the power needs to be. Ah, uh, okay. So now we go all the way around. No bounce or anything. Oh, baby. That's close. This is every single, <laughs> every single like time we play this game for sub night. It's always just a collection of just, just innuendo. Like just time. I mean, it's first off it's balls. Of course, of course. And balls and holes. Okay. Yeah. Like. Yes, of course, it's going to be nothing but a whole night of innuendo. And then, of course, because of just the gameplay type, you know, the inherent to uh, golf, right? There's that, there's that like, oh, get in, uh, uh, all the grunting and all of the like, and all of the just reactions just tied in there with all the talk about balls and strokes uh, and holes. Uh, so yeah, it's always, it's always a good time, you know, even if it is childish fun, it's still a great fucking time, so, ah, oh, damn it, hurry up, get in, stop, oh my god, please come to a stop, oh, it's a downhill technically, there we go, over the hill and right, uh, too much power, that was my fault, perfect. Oh, man, this is a tough one. Oh, damn it! <laughs> I'm actually standing up right now. Ah. Oh. See? That's what I'm talking about. It's, 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 it's a very clip-worthy... Um, oh, jeez. It's a very clip-worthy uh, game style. Golf, right? Just in general. Fuck. I don't want to retire because we already got a map to show you, which again, like, wow, I really wish we had a uh, uh, level editor because then we would never run out of maps. Infinite Mini Golf has infinite number of maps. Uh, Golf It has lots and lots of workshop maps because of the, uh, the editor. Oh, this is embarrassing. 
This is embarrassing. Can I just re-record the? Can I start the whole episode over and just just do that? <laughs> Fuck. How do I reset? What is the reset button in this? That's yeah, a free camera. I don't want the free camera. Thank you. Oh. <sighs> okay. Oh, this is a good one. This is a good one. Bounce off this wall here. Pop it up top. Mm, usually I make that, but not this time because I'm recording. There we go. And then you have to make it across the other side. Super easy, right? Set yourselves up like this. Actually, there's a clip of me somewhere uh, nailing this from here. Damn. And it was great. It was glorious. Oh, man. But it'll never happen again. <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> uh, I am determined now. We are going to do this or I'm going to stroke out. All right. That's that's, yeah, that's close enough, I guess. I totally dunked it from over there, man. I swear. I promise. I promise. I promise. There was, was, there was a time when I dunked it from across the from from downfield. It was great. All right. Let's get up this hill. Oh, number no, number of uh, other turns. That's a terrible place to put that. Oh, still made it though. And this is the correct hole. Spoilers. Birdie! Make up for that last one. Last two. Jeez. Oh, this is a great one. Because uh, you have this thing at the head. Hit, hit the ball off of, but the arrow actually amplifies your... The ball speeds. So you have to get it just right. Like that. I don't believe there's a way to hole in one this, but I'm sure somebody. Yes, there is actually. Yeah, look at that. There's this angle here will get you there, huh? I don't believe I ever tried to hole in one this thing. Let's see. Oh my god! <laughs> Just give it to me, man. I need to make up for all these for the for uh, four and five, whole four and five. Just full power of this, I think. Ooh, careful, careful. Too much power. He'll throw you right off the map. And that's a that's a jump right there. Get just enough power to get there. Nice. Nice. The pole, actually. The uh, the flag pole actually stopped me. It is a physical object, so. Good. So, so par is 60. Here we go. You could cross the bridge if you want to, or... Or... No, 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 no. <laughs> this is the worst thing that could happen now. Because <laughs> this is so far out of the way. I'm gonna go up. I gotta go back over here. Try it again. I ain't gonna try it again. No, 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 no. Uh, fine. All right. Well, I guess we're gonna cross the other uh, bridge then. I can't hit this too hard because it bounce off over the thing. There we go. Perfect. Ay, jeez. There's not really much else to say. You know, like, they all have, like I said, they all have their own uh, thing that they contribute to the miniature golf uh, series of online games that you can play, right? Or online multiplayer games. You know, a lot of indie games, they don't, they don't have online multiplayer. But miniature golf is, nobody goes and plays miniature golf by themselves. Right? Nobody goes regular golfing by themselves. So it's like, it, it, so it makes sense that, you know, you don't, you don't have, and I would never even consider playing a game, uh, uh, a miniature golf game that didn't have multiplayer. Because of that reason. It's just like, it's inherent to the game itself. Just it wouldn't make any sense to do it otherwise. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's otherwise, it's, there's not really a whole lot else to show you guys. Like there's, we're, we're, we're wrapping up the series. We have golf, uh, infinite mini golf. We have golf it and we have golf with your friends. And like I said, you know, the level editor for this is going to be a huge determining factor of where this thing places for some of you. Personally, I do feel like the because of the uh, the different gameplay styles you can have soccer uh, or sorry, uh, 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 
hockey. Oh man, this one. Oh my God, this one. <sighs> you know, uh, uh, basketball, hockey, regular golf, right? Because of different gameplay styles and stuff you could do, please stop. Fuck. Uh, once you add in an editor and you could do, and each, ed each um, map has like three different ways you could tackle it, that's awesome. Regular golf, basketball, hockey. That's freaking great, right? Hold on. That was the best I've ever done at that map. That is so, that map is such a pain in the ass. Nice, that jump right there, that, that moving bridge. <sighs> but like I said, you know, golf with your golf, infinite mini golf is the most polished of the group. It is the most expensive of the group. Uh, and it's got a, you know, an, an, I can appreciate the progression system, the unlocks, all that stuff. But the, hold on, let me see if I can slide in here. But without playing it online, I can't really tell you guys how the online experience is for golf, for uh, infinite mini golf. But I'm gonna assume that it's probably about the same as, as golf and golf with your friends because that part doesn't really seem to change. I mean, it's, it's mini golf. Like, what, what kind of complexity can you really add by making a multiplayer outside of collision, right? And the different ball types and all that stuff. Man, there's let's see about five more strokes to get uh to get par. Jesus, what can I do that? Let me see. Oh, I already messed up. Oh, oh no, okay, messed up. <laughs> done. We're done. I've told you everything you need to know to make an educated decision on which mini golf game you want to get. But if you were gonna pick up two, I would say definitely get golf it and golf with your friends because that pretty much covers all the bases without any of the extra flourish and everything. Because Playing online with your friends isn't going to matter when you customize your avatar. No one cares about that kind of stuff, right? Personally, I don't think anyone cares about that kind of stuff. Once this thing gets a, a level editor, obviously it's going to add a little bit more complexity to it. Uh, but still, Golf With Your Friends does remain. It does edge out uh, Golf It. Um, see, edge out. See, more balls and holes jokes. Uh, it does, I believe, beat out uh, Golf It, but just a little bit. Golf is great with the level editor and everything, but once this thing has a level editor, I, I firmly believe that it's going to... Uh, uh, become the uh, the best one. It's also right now it's the cheapest. So that's always that's always a uh, an incentive to pick up. <laughs> it's like well, those three mini golf games. Well, this one's uh, half the price or a third of the price of the the most expensive of the three. So yeah, definitely worth picking up. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoy this look at these three games. I felt like it's kind of silly for me not to even cover one of them given how how often I've played. Or how much I play golf with your friends and golf it just didn't make any sense not to cover these things. So I hope you guys appreciate it. Um, I hope I provided some pretty good info. Uh, you know, sometimes what happens is I play a game so off so much that some things become assumed. And so I'll I'll, leave, I'll omit certain things. Usually I try to keep any for breakfast as more of a first impressions type of uh, type of videos because you know first impressions is usually what everything that is that things that you'd want to know about is all stuff that I just recently learned. So it's all fresh in my mind. Whereas Playing, uh, showing a game that I've played tons of hours in can sometimes be difficult because there's a lot of stuff I would overlook because it becomes assumed uh, in my own gameplay. So I'll forget to mention it, you know? Uh, like for example, in the case of uh, Golf Golf with Friends and Infinite Mini Golf, uh, the way that the ball is actually hit, right? How you stroke is different in every single game, you know? So that's all really important stuff to bring up. Um, so yeah, if you guys have any questions about any of these, please feel free to hit me up. Hit me up on Twitter, comments, wherever you want. But that's it. Golf with your friends. Indy for breakfast and Mike B. All those things are happening right here. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye.